The first Dayton Cancer Center is getting a new piece of technology. And here to tell us more about the cyber knife is Dr. Edward Hughes. Welcome, Dr. Hughes. Well, thank you for giving me the opportunity to talk about first Dayton Cancer Care and first Dayton Cyber Knife. Yes. Cyber Knife is really breakthrough technology. Yeah, for what cancer is what patients. is Cyber Knife? Cyber Knife, despite its name, is not surgery. Mm -hmm. There's no pain, there's no incision. Cyber Knife is probably the most sophisticated radiation technology in the world. It has three components. First of all, it has a linear accelerator, a radiation generating machine, mm -hmm. and it's on a robotic arm okay. with exquisite precision. It's submillimeter precision. The robot can move that linear accelerator within the width of a human hair. And then we couple that with a very sophisticated imaging system. Mm -hmm. So for me, I can not only see the tumor in real time, I can also see the organs that are around that tumor. Wow. And what it does, it allows me to paint that cancer with radiation, with submillimeter accuracy, and spare normal tissue. It's really a radiation specialist dream. Well, now, you, you mentioned that there is no pain associated with it. Yeah. So how exactly is this going to benefit Dayton patients specifically? Well, it's going to benefit Dayton patients, those mm -hmm. patients with brain tumors, mm -hmm. with early stage lung cancer, early stage breast cancer, mm -hmm. prostate cancer. Because compared to traditional radiation therapy, CyberKnife treatments are done within one week, within three to mm -hmm. five treatments. They're done as an outpatient. Patients can actually drive themselves really? to and from the treatments. Wow. Treatments take 30 minutes for brain tumor patients, about 40 minutes for prostate and breast patients, That's and about an hour for lung cancer patients. But let me emphasize, patients can drive themselves. There's no pain, there's no incision. And the robot very safely, very slowly moves around them. Mm -hmm. In fact, most of the patients doze off, they listen to their music or we provide them their favorite music. Mm -hmm. And this is really world-class treatment right here in Dayton. Wow. This is the only cyber knife in Southwest Ohio and it's the third such cyber knife in the entire state of Ohio. Neat. My alma mater, Johns Hopkins, in fact, just started the cyber knife treatment a couple of months ago. Really? So and right here in Dayton, we have world-class technology, yeah. world-class cancer treatment. Really so leading the way with it. Absolutely. Yeah. And so patients can don't have to leave home. They don't have to leave their loved ones, their family, mm -hmm. their jobs. They can be done in one week. And that's been the goal of First Dayton Cancer Care since we opened in 2003. Now, you wow. mentioned it can be done in one week. Does that mean that it's one treatment, or do they go back for several treatments over the course of that week? It really depends on the kind of cancer you have. For some brain tumor patients, we can do it in one treatment. For lung cancer patients, it's done in three to five treatments, depending on the size and shape and location of the lung cancer. Prostate patients, it's done in five treatments. Mm -hmm. But that's a tremendous advance compared to traditional radiation therapy at ordinary centers, where it's done over eight to nine weeks mm -hmm. daily on a Monday to Friday basis. So here our goal again, get the patient back to their family, get back to your life faster. That's yeah. basically what we strive to do at First Aid and Cancer Care. Sure. Well, it definitely sounds like the cyber knife is a really good option for some patients. Now, talk about some of the other treatments that you offer at the First Aid and Cancer Center. We opened in 2003, and my goal was really to bring the best in radiation medicine to the patients at Dayton because they deserve the best. Right. And what we have at First Aid and Cancer Care, we have the complete armamentarium. We have all the technology available at any of the major medical centers in the country. And patients can, can get treated right at home in a very people-oriented mm -hmm. cancer center. My staff, myself, our job is to get patients back to their life quicker and quality of life is what it's about. Even as a cancer doctor, sure. quality yeah. of life is what it's about. Um, and that's what the patients want. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for that well, information. Thank you. thank you, Dr. Hughes. Now,